Let's make a new exercise. Here we will make a gradual hole with instance to vary features. And uh, you will see all dimensions are in millimeter, all fillets 0.4. Now hole. There are many holes. The main hole diameter here given 13, 3 millimeter, 13 holes. Increment 0.25. All the holes going to gradually increase the diameter diameter 0.25 and the gap between two 15 millimeters gap increase 1.5 times gradually okay see here whole gap increase everything is written let's make first cone size 20 51 including thickness so we will uh, remove thickness 50 millimeter r5 and this outer diameter 100 okay and thickness 1 millimeter so let's do front plane sketch activate here line feature okay go back to the point and see the line is converted into arc press escape key to out now let me select these two lines for construction A smart dimension now this diameter given 20 now distance from here to top 1 minus 51 it's 50 okay and distance from center to here keep diameter 100 radius 30 millimeter go to feature and activate revolve boss base feature here uncheck because I don't want to close now here axis of revolution select this one now thin feature activated thin feature how much one millimeter and uh, material let me select should go outside okay material flow here one mm outside and material from here inside that's it okay okay let's now let's make this hole 30, 15 and 3 millimeter. Remember this increment and there are 13 number of holes. So I'm going to choose here top plane sketch center line. Press escape key to out. Now let me select circle. Draw one circle, A smart dimension. 3 millimeter 30 and let me define this distance 15 millimeter okay now go to feature and I want to make hole on this so I am going to choose wrap feature okay now here wrap type here choose deboss I want to remove material and wrap method this is not circular method. This is a kind of spline surface. So I am going to choose spline. Now this one selected here, select surface. I am going to select this surface. Now once you select, you will see this is going to project on this. You don't need to define any pull direction. Thickness 1 millimeter. I am going to keep 1 millimeter. Say OK. And see the hole is created. OK. Now let's go to circular pattern. Before going circular pattern here choose. Okay. Show feature dimension. This is important dimension we need it. Which dimension we need this angle. This three degree. And this 15 degree these things we are going to use okay now activate circular pattern now first I'm going to choose a circular edge instance spaces 15 and uh, here I am going to make 13 number of holes. Okay. Now feature. 
let me select this wrap wrap one now come down you will see the preview instances to vary now here select first dimension I'm going to choose this whole increment click this dimension now see here it appears here now increment according to drawing it's 1.5 enter now second time I'm going to select angle see there is an angle oh no not angle I'm going to select this uh, diameter because I want to increase the whole size also now see here it appears whole see diameter and increase this whole 0 0.25 enter now system going to calculate now you will see the preview see how these holes are created say yes and uh, now I am going to use normal feature circular pattern now here I am going to choose this circular edge equal spacing 360 and here I want to make 6 number of instances 6 number of patterns now here either choose feature feature let's say this circular pattern is feature or either you can choose here faces to pattern you can select all whole one by one from here so there is a two method so simple one I am going to choose this one now let's uh, calculate now you will see the preview now you don't need to define anything else just simply say yes it will take time now here the procedure is finished now you can right click uncheck show feature dimension now let me save first gradual holes fillet choose here constant size 0 0.4 and I am going to select this surface because I want to apply hole only the upper edge of this hole not back side so simply say yes Don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in SOLIDWORKS. Thanks for watching.